like a prison with invisible bars No matter where you at, it always follow you where you are And it's hard out there for a pimp to get out of But it's harder for the hooker that he beat the shit out of I got niggas underground in the confederate states Ironically running from slavery that prison creates So I never hate on the south, I respect their vision I just hate on niggas that promote samboism And white execs that love to see us in that position They reflect the stereotypes of America's vision They want us dancing, cooning and hollering Only respect us for playing sports and modeling More than racism, it's stay in your placism More people are trapped in practical black facism So fuck a civil war between the north and the south It's between field niggas and slaves that are stuck in the house Civil war for the soul of a nation This is a struggle to save civilization Demonstration Looks like we got another shooting in Sacramento and it's getting a little close to home. Uh, I mean, there's shootings all the time, but. It seems like block by block. Just like everywhere else I live. But, yeah, you hear the helicopters going around. Uh, it's not too far away from me. So, I'm assuming. Yeah, yeah, it was quite interesting. And just a briefing. Someone's in serious condition. <laughs> Jeez. Vehicle to vehicle, shots fired. One man hit. Car crashed in oncoming vehicle. He's in crit critical condition. So, Chops is on the lookout. Watch out. New map from EPA, I guess. It wants to load. This is from Conservative Bite. I think. Yeah, Conservative Bite. Makes that, yeah, yeah. The screen over here is so bright. Can't see what I can't see on this screen what's on this screen. EPA developing secret maps they don't want you to know about. Take a bite out of liberalism. And now the page is going to fuck with me. So, uh, map developed by the EPA released to a House committee investigating controversial proposed water regulations should have citizens concerned. It certainly alarming the EPA would develop these maps in secret and only release them after being confronted by members of Congress. The EPA has been hiding information which could upset the public and jeopardize its massive power grab of unprecedented authority over private and public water. The maps were released by the EPA to the House Science, Space and Technology Committee. Uh, one map shows perennial bodies of water in blue and intermittent bodies of water in yellow. A second regional map including North Dakota, South Dakota, Montana, Wyoming, Colorado, and Utah uses blue to show each state's wetlands inventory. Agenda 21 on that map nearly the entire state of North Dakota is in blue. Critics of the proposed rule have suggested the EPA intends to use it to expand regulation far beyond permanent bodies of water to lands that hold water only some of the time. It doesn't take much water, uh, it doesn't take much of a leap to conclude these highly detailed maps developed with taxpayer funds are for the purpose of enforcing this rule. Uh, they say that the map has nothing to do with waters of the U.S. rule. Well, if they're on the United States property, they do have something to do with it, buddy. <laughs> The EPA has regulatory authority over U.S. waters, but it's unclear how that authority extends to non-permanent bodies of water. 
In New Mexico, one landowner has already experienced the federal government attempting to regulate w uh, wetlands that aren't already always wet. And in 2013, a landowner was prohibited by federal authorities who cited the Clean Water Act from cleaning out a dry creek bed. Some of the same shit they did with Bundy and his ranch in Nevada. Now folks, this is an old story. This is from uh, August 31st, 2014. But, a lot of uh, cities now are passing a lot of water shit. Um, they're starting to, I notice a lot of places around the country starting to build up their levees and shit. Especially out here. And I've done videos on the Natomas levy uh, about all that shit. But anyways, let's check out the EPA map anyways. So you come to the EPA. EPA maps. Okay. And there's the, uh, how you get there. GIS.EPA.IE. Okay. And, uh, they got all kinds of maps that you can look at. These are geo portals. Ooh. <laughs> there's the map viewer. And here's the different maps they got. You can get your local environment. See what's going on in your neighborhood. Which out here in Sacramento, I can tell you, they're spraying us like fucking bugs. Uh, Nate did a video on that a long time ago. Splash bathing water quality. Okay, general EPA spatial data using this GIS browser. This shows you levels and shit like that. And folks, if it's over 1,000 times, I believe, 2500 something like that the government is supposed to get involved some of these are 25,000 and over some of them I believe a million times checking the air quality might be good so what you want to do is come over to the EPA website right there Come on down to the community. And here it will show you laws and regulations. That's new drinking water mapping application. You might want to check it out. Laws and regulations. Here you have the climate change one. Toxic release inventory. It's a nice one to check. Which is what we're gonna check. And if you look in I wanna say this one. I'm not sure how. Or it might be this one. One of these. You'll find the uh, state codes which say what is allowed and what isn't allowed in like your water supply stuff like that like fluoride so let's go to this again I went through this before they're part of department of the interior Clean air markets, radiation protection standards. Now, here are some of the maps in question. Uh, these are the ones that were commissioned by the EPA. So, I mean, I'm, I don't know how much I would trust them. Uh, since the EPA keeps raising the levels of everything, including the radiation, uh, we should have been notified a long time ago and been ordered to be taken potassium iodide at the very least. At the very least. So I'm not quite sure what these tables show, but 
and this map really isn't too visible or anything. But there, that's the blueprint for uh, water control. EPF made secret maps for a new regulatory push. Again, August 27, 2014. This is about 12 days later. Set the stage for a controversial plan to expand regulatory power over streams and wetlands. There's the map. Link for the maps. So it looks like everybody's making a push. The EPA, the BLM, everybody. The police, the government. They're all poking at us. They're fucking poking us. You like that? <laughs> fucking poking us, folks. For real. They're seeing what's going to set us off. I mean, yeah, you might want to look at some of the subcommittees because I'm sure a lot of them are involved in the fucking government oversight my balls these are all the people that should be hung right here for fucking raising the levels and breaking all sorts of fucking laws and ethics violations I could go on for days with those so there you go go to your state and they got different regions yeah look how many those are the FEMA regions yeah the Fucking crazy, huh? About the the ten FEMA regions. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> oh shit. Let's see what we got in the dry golden state. This is the PDF, so it's gonna take a minute to load. Now you got Rubio and Cruz, the Cubanas, taking off against Trump. What a surprise. Folks, uh, let me let you in a little secret here. Hillary Clinton has already won the presidency. Okay, it's obvious because Jeb Bush has gotten out. So, it's your next president. Okay. Unless Obama goes for a third term, and he can only do that if a war breaks out or martial law is declared. They've been training for an awful lot of martial law lately, haven't they, folks? Just saying. I'm just saying, man. You ball, baby. So all this stuff in the blue is pretty much the conservation, the lakes, the reservoirs, what they'll use for uh, drinking water, you know, reservoir. I'm not quite sure what wash, I don't know, maybe that's for you guys out here <clears throat> but you can see uh, this is all Sacramento and Modesto and all that shit Yuba let's see what that is canal ditch I believe There's not going to be any more water in Sacramento, that I believe. <laughs> of 
hopefully there won't be like 14 feet Um, I don't know. I don't really follow tabled maps like this, so if somebody else wants to get in into this shit, go right ahead. But it's another map for you from EPA. God bless and carry on.